How's it going everyone? Welcome to another video. This is going to be how to cable manage your cables uh, outside your case instead of inside, which you've probably seen more of. Um, but a really nice organized uh, cable management outside your case can make a computer really shine, uh, can make your desk look a lot neater, and just overall be a lot easier to work with stuff. Um, so we're going to do top five basically. Uh, and all the products, uh, I'll have the Amazon links in the description and I'll be posting the prices as we go along. They're all about five to fifteen dollars, pretty cheap stuff. Uh, there's only a couple that reach over 10. Um, but yeah, let's start it up. All right, so number one, uh, I say a nice wall-mounted surge protector can keep your power cords all nice and clutter-free. Uh, a lot of people get the ones that you plug in and it lays on the ground and all your cords plug in the top of it, but that can get really messy. Um, so this way I have a Globe electric swivel, six outlet uh, surge protector. They also carry a model with two USBs on the top uh, in case you have like, uh, I don't know, charging your phone or a lot of stuff is USB powered now. So two USB powers on the top, it's a little more expensive, um, but I didn't get that one. I got the normal one with uh, just six hubs. Uh, they tilt, it's a great way to keep all the cords off the ground and so it's not just sitting there next to your computer or under your legs or whatever. Uh, it's not jutting out of the wall too much either and you can uh, turn the two swivels on the side so that the cords can come out uh, left and right instead of poking out of the wall. Um, you can also try actually mounting your power bar if you do have one on the ground. Uh, you won't get the swivel advantage, but it at least will be off the ground. Uh, you just usually put like a nail or two in the wall, uh, and you can see on the backs of all of them, they have the little holes where you like hooks in and slides down. Uh, so I'd recommend doing that. Um, but if you don't want to get the adjustable angle of the plugs like that one, then you know, I would recommend just buying this one. It's only, I think, $15. What is it? Uh, $14.99. Yeah, $15. Uh, pretty cheap, uh, and it really makes your cords look a lot neater. All right, for the second one, uh, most people like to use zip ties for cables management, but for the outside cables that can be seen, I found that electrical tape works great and is much cleaner looking than zip ties, in my opinion. I like to group them together as well, so as you can see, I have all my USB cables together, all my audio cables together, and all my power cables and display cables. All those are grouped together, so that way it's easier for me to manage, and I'll use like maybe a little zip tie to group them, but I'll keep that away, and then I'll use the tape to keep them a little tighter. Uh, but of course it needs to spread out once it starts plugging stuff in, but it just looks really neat um, If you have some larger cords like maybe a giant bundle of maybe if like five displays who knows Maybe like a lot more cables that wouldn't really make sense to use tape. Uh, you can get these sleeves So uh, they're pretty cheap too. Let's see how much for these uh, The sleeves are $11.99, but you get this giant roll uh, and you can cut it to whatever length you want They're velcro so you just wrap it around it, it keeps them all together I do it for my cords behind my monitor. I have lights around monitors too, so I put all those power cords in there. And so it just looks a lot cleaner. It's just one giant, uh, basically, tube instead of all these little wires coming out. Uh, it just looks a lot cleaner and a lot neater uh, than anything else. All right, for number three, uh, I actually have zip ties on here. I know I've been kind of knocking on them and saying to use tape or anything else, but they are nice to keep cords out of sight behind the desk. Um, where you can't even see the zip tie, it just holds the cables away. So in that case, uh, it's really nice, but I do recommend getting these self-adhesive cable tie mounts. Uh, they're pretty cheap, you get like a hundred of them for seven bucks or six bucks. Um, so they just basically have a little adhesive, you roll off, it is actually really strong. I think it's like super glue or something, because if you stick it on a table, it's pretty hard to get off without prying underneath it. Uh, you can put this anywhere underneath the table, on the back of the table, on the wall, and then you have a nice little spot where you can zip tie uh, cables to, so that they're out of the way. You can't even see it, and it's all hidden. Now if you really don't like zip ties, and you don't want to use them at all, even with the adhesive mounts, which occasionally can fall off depending on the surface uh, that you put them on, uh, you can use these little nail clamps. I don't even know exactly what the name for them would be. Um, but you can check them out. It's like a hundred dollars uh, or a hundred of them for six dollars. Super cheap and basically it secures a cable into drywall or I guess anything you can nail it into. Uh, they're main, mainly meant for ethernet cables. That's the thickness but of course they work for any bundle of cables you can fit in there. All right last but not least I have for your cables to your desk like not the cables behind your computer but actual mouse, keyboard, microphone, whatever you have the cables running to your desk. Um, you can use desktop cable holders is basically what they're called. They don't have a, really have a good name. Uh, link will be in the description. It includes a variety of sizes. Um, I have the ones that have three little slots for cables, but there's also ones with one or two, uh, depending on how many cables you have or location where you want them. Uh, you can actually also try using these for routing cables behind because uh, they do have adhesive backs to stick to your desk, but you can also use them to um, put on like maybe the back of your desk or the wall, and so that way you can route all the cables nice and neatly behind there and keep them all separated. I haven't tried that myself, but that's also very useful. I just use the zip tie adhesives, 
but that also can be a very good use for this and it keeps all your cables nice and organized when they're going from your desk to the back of your desk like behind it. All right guys, that is it for my list of top five cable management outside the case ideas. Uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any other ideas and uh, have a good night, good day, whenever you guys are watching this and I'll see you in the next one.